Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today on J. Bob and Sons, I have so many cards for sale. <laughs> uh, these are all cards that are in and around my desk. <clears throat> I, I am like sinking in, in, in so many cards that, you know, I, I think I'm going to have plans for, then they just kind of sit around. Um, I, I need to get organized. Um, I want to get rid of some cards. And so today I'm going to do that. Um, so what I want you to do is uh, basically with this type of video is go ahead in the comments below, let me know what lot you want. Um, and, um, and uh, that will be, I'll go in order based on uh, people saying that they want the lot. Uh, and then go ahead and email me in the description below. I'll put my email address. Uh, go ahead and email me. It's uh, jbobinsons at gmail. And I'll put that address uh, down in the uh, uh, description below. And then um, we will finish the transaction. So basically, um, I put a, I, I'm doing a, a little bit different this time, just with some like standard uh, shipping for this, just because the shipping does kind of get expensive. But uh, basically, three dollars. Uh, so any any of the lots, you're, you're, they're going to go for this price, plus uh, three dollars shipping, uh, and that'll be, you know, this won't be in a bubble mailer. This is a, so many. So this will go to. So basically. If it's just a few cards, it'll go in a bubble mailer with tracking. If not, it'll go in a box with tracking. Um, Three dollar flat, flat, flat shipping, and that's if you buy one card. And if you buy like a giant box, you know it's fine. I'm just gonna do three dollars shipping. Um, so it'll be whatever you buy plus three bucks shipping. Um, and then you know I have no problem shipping stuff uh, anywhere. Um, so I know a lot of my viewers are in like Australia, Canada. <laughs> so if you want some of these cards. I'm gonna do an $8 flat shipping. Again, that'll be a bubble mailer with tracking if it's just a few cards. If it's a big box, you know, it'll just be the eight bucks, okay? And that's that's just if you get one card and you want it shipped to Canada, or if you get in a box of cards, it's still gonna be, I'm gonna charge you eight bucks, okay? And we'll, and we'll hammer that through the email uh, back and forth to finalize the deal. I'm gonna accept PayPal. Uh, PayPal is uh, friends and family preferred, if not, uh, um, goods and services is fine. Um, and then also cash app. I can accept cash app as well. And I can also email you that information uh, when we get, um, you know, when, when we finalize the deal. So getting started, I'm going to have some soccer. So uh, a lot of my viewers end up being uh, people interested in soccer. Um, I have a uh, I, I have a lot of really nice cards here. So I'm going to start off with this lot. This is all the newest Champions League. Okay, so this all came out in, uh, this is the 2020 uh, Champions League. So this is the set that has the rookie emblems for Holland, uh, Erling Holland, and um, uh, Ansu Fati. So those cards are not in here. <laughs> so those those cards are not in here. But there's still a lot of really nice, uh, like Neymar Jr. There's still like Mohamed Salah. Uh, really big stars in here. And these are all really nice uh, chrome cards. There's still uh, quite a few. Uh, like that was a hollow, a future star, uh, Klosterman. Um, tons and tons. This is huge stack. These are all actually sleeved up, um, but not everything is sleeved up. So, and and all the hits are all the hits that were not you know um, like there's no. I took out the Lionel Messi and. Um, uh, Cristiano Ronaldo. I took out some of those guys, um, so that you're not going to have those guys in here. But you are going to have, you know, some other nice hits in here. Like there's a sparkle card that came in. Um, the, some of these are numbered. Uh, these are some of the hits that came in a hobby box I ripped of this, and some of these are the hollows back here. So, not a lot of nice cards for sure. If you're building this set, if you're just getting into soccer, great place to start in um the champions league this is all brand new stuff right here this is all prism this is all brand new prism soccer and these are all rookie cards has the rookie card emblem you can see here um i was gonna make a big push to get into prism soccer there's nico williams so this, these are all rookies um it's not all rookies it's a bunch of rookies there's a nice uh pink um pulsar there's salah um so a bunch of nice rookies and hollows in here. 
There's sterling. I got a couple of them. Uh, so you can see nice um, red and um, these are all just base here as well. So all these are in really great shape. I'm not going to sleeve all these base. I mean, but they are in really nice condition. All this will just go like in a box, right? So a huge stack of Prism Soccer Rookies. This is the brand new goodness that's out. Plus all of these uh, Topps Chrome. This is probably like hundreds of dollars worth of cards right here. Uh, we're, this is going to be the called the this is the Prism and Champions League lot. This is ninety dollars. Uh, whoever wants this, ninety dollars plus the shipping that we just described, and that goes to whoever wants it. Okay, this is more soccer, and then you know we'll switch into baseball after the soccer. Um, this is a pretty cool lot. So um, this is uh, Mason Greenwood, and his cards are on fire. This card alone. So this is a pink pulsar of Mason Greenwood for Manchester U. Uh, this card alone is selling for almost $200 on eBay. Um, but you can have that one, um, uh, a couple of these, a couple of these other guys, Billy Gilmore's rookie card, um, uh, Connor Cody. This is like the, the orange or red, uh, pulsar, a couple of the nicer rookies and some hollows in here. Um, and some, some rookie cards that are, uh, some parallels. So, all of these cards, 200 bucks shipped. So pretty smoking deal. Uh, you want to get into soccer, 200 bucks for just that lot right there. All right. Now, uh, that's all I have for the soccer right now. Let's get into some baseball. I got all sorts of stuff here, guys. I got Pokemon cards, baseball, basketball, football, garbage pail kids, new garbage pail kids, and vintage garbage pail kids. So check it out. All right. Here, I got a lot right here. Um, these are all... I don't know if anybody collects these, but excuse me, these are all the commemorative patches. So we got Steve Carlson. So somebody might be collecting these. Unfortunately, these come out, these come out of the pack a little dinged up. Um, there's a nice Frank Thomas one. So this is all from the Tops 2020, 20, uh, I'm sorry, the Tops 2021. There's Cal Ripken. But there's some others in here too. Like here's a Glaber Torres patch. We got a Andrew McCutcheon patch. Buster Posey patch, that's from a different set. Jose Altuve patch. This is just a manufactured Bieber. Um, this is a this is a case hit. This is the I think out of actually I don't. Um, yeah, 2020 Chrome. This is a case hit from Chrome. It's numbered out of 99. Um, and then we got Eddie Matthews. More of the 2021 stuff. Joe Morgan. We got Steve Carlton again and Jackie Robertson again. So all these, 10 bucks. If, if somebody is really into these patches and you want to take these all down. So that one is like a patch right there. I forgot the from mark there. So 10 bucks, 10 bucks for all these if you are interested. Okay, rookies. This is a huge stack of rookies. I'm going to sell them all 40 bucks, okay? 40 bucks for all these rookies mixed sets like all sorts of stuff it's mostly rookies uh, and then like some like nicer like parallel cards and i am completely disorganized you know so here's like you know uh jordan alvarez rookie card from um uh i forget the name of the set it's totally losing me um ah the big league tops big league yeah so um anyway so I'll just go through. Here's Andrew Benatendi's rookie card. I mean, what what is, what is that even? That's twenty. That's twenty seventeen. Dietrich's gold card. So there's gold cards in here, but mostly it's just rookies. So all sorts of sets. I mean, series one, series two, um, update. I mean, I can go through some of these. There's nice Yu Chang. There's Sean Murphy numbered rookie opening day. The red foil. Um, Kino, I mean, it goes on and on. It, I mean, there is a ton of cards here. And these are all just going to go into like a card box. I'm just going to mail them to you, um, you know, with that shipping fee. So you're going to get all these cards for 40 bucks plus the shipping. Uh, so some foils, Starling Marte there. I mean, a lot of stuff in here, just lots of rookies. Zach Gallen, all mostly rookies. I mean, some of them are not. Some of them are like, this is a cool chrome 
Turkey Red. That's a short print, I think, of Jackie Robinson. There's Bo Bichette Prism. So, like I said, different sets. Um, more rookies here. Um, and then just other kind of like noteworthy cards, I think. Not sure. There's Brandon Lowe, rookie. And just all sorts of stuff. You're like, you don't even know what you're going to find in here. Um, the bottom here is a bunch of, uh, and then you, at the bottom here, there's a bunch of rookies from um, Heritage uh, that recently came out. And these are all the rookies. So basically all the rookies that I could pull out of Heritage. Uh, minus minus any, uh, I, I, I'm pretty sure I took out and might have sent to PSA any like Boba Shets. But basically all the other rookies that I had in here. I mean, there's a lot, there's a lot of cards here. Though there's quite a, quite a lot. Um, there's Kyle Lewis, some Chrome, some Chrome Turkey Reds in there. Another Bo Bichette. I mean, all sorts of cards I could go on. And on. So anyway, all of these cards, you guys, here's just like some foils, some foils. Um, so you're collecting the foil cards. Um, anyway, all these, all of this, 40 bucks. I'm calling this the rookies lot. So if anyone's interested, 40 bucks plus shipping. Take it all down. All right. So that's that. Um, the next lot I have up is a $60 Chrome rookies lot. So these are all the nicest Chrome cards that came out of Chrome Update and Chrome 2020. Um, I think it's mostly Update. Like here's the Aristides Aquino rookie debut not all these are sleeved but you know here's some there's the jesus lazardo uh mejia so you can see and, and not all of them are rookies like here's just the cool ozzy smith that's in there um some parallels in there as well i mean i don't even i actually don't even know everything that's out of 99 matthew boyd that's pretty cool um there's miggy kind of refractor i think that was probably out of 2020 and then all these just they're mostly all the good cards. <laughs> so all the good ones. I'm just getting rid of cards, guys. Here's here's some trout in there. Um, just a lot of rookies, basically, in Chrome. Probably worth a lot more than what I'm selling it for. But there's Cal Ripken Jr. So there, you know, there's a bunch of the Griffies in there. Chrome Griffies. Davis, Eric Davis. All right, and so you can see there is a lot, a lot of cards in here, you guys. Some of them are sleeves, some of them are not. They're all just going to go into a box and headed your way for 60 bucks. There's nice Jordan Alvarez, rookie debut, Jesus Luzardo, Gavin Lux, Decades Best, Aristides Aquino again. Here's, here's, some, uh, here's some Sapphire. I think that's Sapphire update. Kind of cool cards there. So just a lot of cards. There's Joey Gallo or Joey Votto Pink, rather, Ricky Henderson. Um, yeah, ton of cards. So don't have time to get through all of them, you guys, but you know, if you're interested, 60 bucks. Um, whole bunch of chrome headed your way. A lot of nice cards in there. So if you're interested, and they're all rookies, so mostly rookies, as you can see. There's some like Griffey and Mark McGuire in there, stuff like that. Okay. Next up, here's a, here's an interesting, here's a really interesting uh, lot. Um, you know, it's going to be the Bobby Witt and Wander Franco lot, uh, plus some extras as well. So let me go ahead and get this get this organized. Um, okay, we're going to start off with some Wander Franco. So this whole lot right here, um, this is a really cool paper card of Wander Franco. This is first edition paper. Um, prospect card so not the bowman first but the prospect card is still selling for quite a quite a lot of money right there uh, plus just some of the regular paper uh just the regular paper and regular chrome um of wander franco and this is the 2020 uh bowman and so this is not his bowman first but um this is miguel amaya bowman first mojo really nice card um and it's always kind of nice collecting the Bowman first mojos because you never know. This guy's going to pop. That's going to be worth a ton of money. Uh, Luciano as well. Bowman first mojo. Boom. How about a Joey Bart chrome? Bowman first. Boom. And then here we go. We got Bobby Witt. This is the 2020. Um, this is the 2020 sort of prospect card in chrome. But here's the real bangers. We got Bobby Witt paper. This thing's selling for crazy amounts of money right now. It's insane. 
but, but just the paper for Bobby Witt because he's really doing a great job in spring training. People are getting pretty hyped. Bobby Witt papers are selling for like 10, 15 bucks a piece. So I got two of them. Plus the big, the big hitter is uh, the Mojo. I actually have some of these boxes still from when this came out. Um, but this is the, yeah, the 20, this is what came out early last year. The uh, Bowman. Uh, mega boxes from Target and Mojo. So this is a very expensive card right now. Raw. I mean, this thing's selling for almost 65, 70 bucks. So you're gonna get all these cards for 85. Okay, so that's Wander, um, Bobby Witt, Joey Bart, Amaya, and another and, and Luciano. All these cards, 85 bucks shipped to your door, plus, or I'm sorry, 85 plus the shipping. And this is I'm calling this the Bobby Witt and Wander Franco lot. So mention that in the comments below if you're interested. Okay, uh, next up, I have a lot more baseball. Uh, let's get into that. Oh, uh, we'll just do this. We'll just do this one real quickly. Uh, mojos, 10 bucks for all these mojos. We got Bryce Harper. Uh, we got a couple Jesus Lazardos, Brandon Lowe, um, Keston Hira, a couple Freddie Freemans, uh, a couple Garrett Coles. Best one is probably this Jorge Soler, and this is out of out of 50, actually. So really nice one there, a gold, I guess. 10 bucks for all the mojos. So it's the mojo lot. Anyone's interested in that? Um, more baseball. How about 25 bucks for uh, Mike Yastrzemski, and this is out of 36. This is an autographed archives. This is a new one that came out, so they... I guess they buy back like a opening day and they stamp it and number it and, and he signs it right across there. So um, 25 bucks. This is selling for 30, 40 bucks right now on eBay. So 25 bucks. We'll take that down. Um, that's football. Here you go. Who's who's excited to see Zach Gallon this year? Um, he's doing pretty good in spring training. Just signed a kind of new contract. This is Zach Gallon's Refractor Rookie Autograph from Topps Chrome. This is Refractor. It's out of $4.99. Really hot card right here. Um, I'm going to sell that one for $20. Bucks. So $20 bucks takes down a nice Zach Gallon. Okay. Let's see what else we got back here. So many cards. All right. For more of the baseball, um, let's do some heavy hitters here. Um... How about this one? Kaboom! We got Luis Roberts, 2018 Prospect Chrome, Gem Mint 10. This is a really nice card. Um, it's selling for upwards of $300 right now on current sales on eBay. We'll do $250 on that one. So $250 for the Lou Bob, first Bowman. I got another Gem Mint 10. We got Ronald Acuna Jr., 2018 Rookie Card, Heritage. Nice, really iconic card there. Um, it's selling for like $120, $130. Uh, I'll do 110, and that's 110 plus our shipping that we've talked about. How about, this is a real banger right here. This is a pop one, N of one. There's only, I mean, there's only one in existence uh, in this, in the population. This is a Topps UK Big Ben variant. So this is actually numbered out of 99. So Kyle Lewis, Rookie of the Year, heading into the new season, has the Rookie of the Year last season. Tops UK edition. I'll sell this one for one hundred and twenty dollars. So one twenty out the door for that Kyle Lewis. I have another Kyle Lewis. Um, this one unfortunately did not grade out well. <laughs> this came back a PSA eight, and uh, this is just you know his base rookie card in the UK variant. So I'll do thirty bucks on that. It's cool, Kyle Lewis. If you're into Kyle Lewis. All right, and this one, this one is hilarious. Like just don't laugh. I. This is all this is this is what happens when you don't look at when you don't examine your cards very well. <laughs> so this is the Jason Dominguez. This is his Bowman first mojo. Um, this is a super hot card. Um, you know, I sent this in. This is all my bad. I sent this card in in, in a stack of cards. Um, and I got this one back and I couldn't believe it got a PSA too. And um, yeah, I you I don't know, I want to show you guys what that what a PSA to see that? See that crease right there? So on the face, I can't, I don't detect anything really on the face, but the back, there's a nice big crease there on the back and that, you know, corners to me, you can kind of see it there. 
No, I just wasn't paying attention. I think I was you know, trying to get a bunch of cards in before I knew the prices were going to increase. Anyway, I sent this in. I'm going to take a loss on it. Um, but if anybody wants it, you know, I'll just I'll just sell it to him for 10 bucks. And you can just say, I got a Bowman. I got a Jason Dominguez. 10 bucks. <laughs> PSA 2. Ah, terrible. Okay. Um, <laughs> let's see what else I got over here. All right. Let's, uh, let's switch it back. I actually have uh some more Whoops. i'm gonna switch it back i'm gonna switch it back to soccer really quick i have some really nice cards uh soccer for soccer fans um here's erling holland so this guy is like like they just call this guy oh he's getting he's getting named a lot of things but he is turning out to be one of the really uh exciting rising stars in soccer um and you know his cards are going up like crazy and you know his rookie chase is a sticker uh, a lot of soccer cards are stickers uh and it's from this set that just came out foosball um and you know his his rookie sticker man i think is selling for like i think um uh Phil's pulls. So the guy that we, you guys have seen his YouTube channel, Phil's pulls. Phil uh, put up on eBay Erling Holland's uh, sticker PSA ten. I think it's already surpassed eight or nine, ten grand. It, it was like eight grand last time I looked, and still had a few days to go. These are from the newest uh, Topps Chrome uh, Champions League. This is the Match Attacks Chrome that came out. This is just like a base and these two are actually numbered. So these are actually really nice. This is out of 150. This is out of 299. So the blue and the purple. I'm going to do both. I'm going to do all these. If you want to get into Holland uh, and start collecting him, there you go. 150 bucks. We'll take that down. So really nice cards here. I actually have some graded up Match Attacks. Um, this is a rookie of Ansu Fati who um is is a really impressive uh young man that is uh yeah, done a lot of great stuff already in his career he has a little bit of a knee injury but um should probably bounce back uh this actually came back this is just the base came back as a psa 8 um i'll do 45 45 bucks on that 40 45 um and then i got some really cool ones too like uh, these are all refractors that came back in pretty good grades the psa 9 of Hugh Min Sun, who's a really, really exciting player. Um, and this came back as a PSA 9. So I'll do 85, 85 bucks on that guy. Um, and I got uh, Mohamed Salah, who's uh, another really exciting player. I actually pulled his Super Refractor in, in, uh, in, a, in a box break of this product, actually. Um, my first ever Super Refractor. Um, I actually ended up, did, I actually did, did end up selling that for quite a lot. Um, this is his, uh, this is a refractor from that set, uh, and, and a PSA nine. Uh, and so I, I, I sent in the, there were just the refractors and I got PSA nine. So I was hoping for tens, but still a really cool card if you collect Salah. And so a hundred bucks on that one. This one is probably the most valuable one. This is, uh, Giovanni Reina, uh, and this is the same PSA nine. It's a refractor, and this is this can be considered a Geo uh, rookie. And so this is a PSA nine refractor rookie. Um, I actually have this one listed on eBay for like six hundred bucks, but you know I'm trying to go below comp. I want to get rid of this stuff. Two hundred bucks for Geo. Two hundred bucks for the Geo. Okay, and then I got of course the goat. I got Lionel Messi refractor. Um, I'll do you know what? I'll do a hundred bucks on this one. So. If anybody wants to take down a messy uh, PSA 9 refractor, that's a pretty good deal um, for the GOAT right there. So Lionel Messi coming out of the 2020 Topps Chrome Match Attacks. So they're pretty cool cards. So 100 bucks on that. Okay, um, how about some football? I got some random football here. Um, and uh, I just kind of want to get rid of some of this. It's just sitting on my desk. Five bucks for all these, plus the shipping we've talked about. Um, we got the rookie rookie card for Davis and Terrell. This is Optic. Um, so these are all rookies for the Optic. We got some veterans. Jerry Rice, this is Mosaic. We got a Will Fuller, Hollow, Aaron Donald, some Mosaic again. And then we got some, like, Jared Goff. Just This is just playoff. Nothing too crazy back here. Um, Henderson rookie. 
Um, there's Jalen Hurts rookie, which is actually a pretty nice one. And it's the purple refractor. Well, you know, not refractor, but purple variant um, of Jalen Hurts coming out of playbook. Um, Cam Akers, Murray rookie. So it's a lot of rookies, basically. Playbook, Mosaic, and Optic. And here's some more purple variants here in the back. So CD Lamb as well. So five bucks for some pretty decent football right there. Take it down. Let me know in the comments below. All right, if says we're on a football kick, how about, hey, can you guys afford the Patrick Mahomes rookie card of Optic? <laughs> PSA 10, I know I can't. <laughs> and uh, and it didn't really even come down that much, um, you know, because he you know, that didn't really work out for the Super Bowl for him this year. But he was up against the, the GOAT, Tom Brady. Um, this is the next best thing. Um, I sent a bunch of these off. Um, but you know, there's quite a lot of these out there on the market now. So, um, if I'll do 80 bucks on this, so it's kind of cool just to have a PSA 10 second year, Patrick Mahomes optic, 80 bucks takes that down. Alrighty then let's see. How about some vintage? How about some vintage basketball? Anybody like Jordan, Michael Jordan or Barkley? How about 89 all-star game, Michael Jordan, NBA hoops. Boom. This is the... Which card is this? Number 200, 1989 Jordan. And uh, Charles Barkley. And this is the 1989 Charles Barkley. So 89 basketball lot, two Jordans and a Barkley. Really nice deal. 30 bucks. He'll take those vintage. Everything Jordan right now is selling for crazy, of course. So that's a really cool lot right there. Um, I got this, I, you know, I wasn't going to sell this thing, but I just figured, hey, I, I got to get rid of some of these cards. So this is the 2017 Panini Hoops Kobe Bryant Teal Explosion. So it's a tribute card. Came back to PSA 9. Um, pretty sick card for any Kobe collectors out there. I'll do 100 bucks on that Kobe. All right. Next up, uh, how about stickers? So um, I just did a box rip of Panini stickers. Here's probably all the hits. I didn't show all the hits on the video. But these are all the these are all the nice rookie stickers. There's a little mellow ball, for example. Um, we got the card for Anthony Edwards. Some of the uh, some of the parallels here, like this one's numbered. You get like a numbered blue out of every box. But we have rookies of Killian Hayes, Denny, um, Bay, Zion, Vassal. A couple of Vassal rookies. There's a Tyrese Halliburton rookie i sleeved him up just separately that's a really nice rookie sticker it's just some john morant there's another lamello ball so lamello balls in there as well anthony edwards so uh pretty cool cards right there um also we got luca in there too so a little uh firework uh sticker and then like the foil as well um what did i put 20 bucks for all this guys that's a that's a smoking deal <laughs> so um, 20 bucks for all the NBA stickers right there. And, uh, I'll do my best to sleeve some of those up. Um, just so you know about the NBA stickers is that, uh, they, they, they often come out of the pack, um, damage. So it's kind of hard to get them really minty. So if you were thinking about getting any of those graded, I just probably wouldn't. Um, so just kind of keep, keep, just keep, you keep you in the loop on that. All right, I do have more basketball. Um, so we got a lot of nice basketball here. Just some base, Aaron Holiday, just some random stuff here on my desk, you guys. That's what this whole video is about. Little, um, got some some rookies, in, some rookies in here. I don't even know where this is. And then this is all the nice stuff back behind here. Here's all um, Don Russ basketball. I just did uh, two blasters, no, two fat packs from a hobby box. Here's all my rookies. Um, so Obi Toppin, um, a lot of nice of the like, nice rookies that came out. There's Denny, so rated rookies, um, uh, plus some of the numbered hits that came out of my box. Or I didn't do a box, rather, just two packs. Still got some nice numbered hits. There's uh, Jared Allen, Evan uh, Fournier. Uh, we got. Zion, Jimmy Butler. So this is all the base. So a bunch of nice basketball. If anyone's interested in those, um, I'll just put that in team bags. 25 bucks for all those rated rookies right there. And 
Let's go switch back to baseball. And then after that, I got some Garbage Pell Kids and some Pokemon cards. So thanks for sticking with me if you're watching through this. Um, here's a Juan Soto lot. All the Juan Soto here, 50 bucks for all these Juan Sotos. So we'll start off with a patch. Nice uh, manufactured relic patch right there. And then just so much, so much Juan Soto right here. So you just see all these cards, just lots and lots of cards. So I wouldn't say that any of these are like gradable. They're in good condition, not like, you know, high grade, but there's a lot of really fun cards. There's a holiday, um, a lot of nice Juan Soto cards in here. This is like a refractor. So if you like Juan Soto, um, I'm just trying to thin my collection. I do have a lot of him. Um, I'm getting more of him. I'm buying a lot more of hit of it graded, graded Soto. Um, so I can just get rid of some of this base I've been like just holding on to. So there you go. Juan Soto lot, 50 bucks. A lot of nice Juan Sotos in there, 50 bucks. And he's obviously a player that a lot of people are interested in doing a lot of good things. So, all right. So I have some Pokemon cards here. Now, uh, if you guys are interested, if you guys like Pokemon like I do, I, I have a hard time selling Pokemon, but I do have so much of it that I figured I could probably get rid of some of this stuff. So here's a lot that I'm gonna do for 15 bucks. So this is a Pinsir GX. We got um, a Shiny, Lucario. We have a um, Matt, or this is a break card. Um, and this is out of, I believe, um, Steam Siege, as well as Professor Sycamore, also out of Steam Siege. That's a full art. Nice ones there. Uh, Rach, uh, Raichu GX. How about Tapu Fini Gold card? Looking pretty good. Decent centering. Um, and some of these are looking pretty good. Like, not a lot of whiting on them. They're all in really good shape. I wouldn't say that. I would say you could probably get a lot of these graded. Here's a Mew, Mewtwo GX, looking pretty clean. Um, here's just an Eevee Hollow. So it's just like a bunch of random stuff. Here's a full art Guzzlord, which looks just absolute mint. You know, the centering on this one looks really, really good. There's like no whitening on it at all. Just looking really clean. So that's actually my favorite Pokemon. I actually, I actually already have that one in a PSA 10. So I figured I could probably sell one of them, but, um, these are all probably worth a lot more than what I'm going to sell them for. So 15 bucks for all that. That's a, that's a smoking deal. I'm not going to lie. Full art shinies are not to be, um, they are actually very valuable. So, but trying to sell this stuff. So <laughs> let's do it. All right. Um, I do have some more Pokemon here. I have two lots that I want to sell and, um, these are pretty cool. So here's lot number one. If anybody's interested in it. We got Hop, Full Art Trainer, and we have the Jesse and James Full Art Trainer. These, um, I believe, are out of Champion's Path, and um, they're really cool, beautiful cards. These are all nicely centered, uh, really no whitening. I'm doing 10 bucks for a Jesse and James and a Hops together. So I have one lot and a second lot. So if you want them both, then it'll be 20 bucks for all, all four cards. But I thought I'd just break it up, see if somebody wanted, so 10 bucks for lot number two, 10 bucks for lot number one. So those are really nice. I think the Jesse and James, I actually pulled so many of them and uh, they are actually going up in value. Kind of cool. Okay. Uh, let's see. And I have just some Garbage Pail Kids here as well. Um, now for the Garbage Pail Kids, I have some of the new stuff. So this is some of the new stuff I have. I have a Hothead Harvey, uh, and that's a refractor. Yeah, it's definitely a little off-centered, um, but if you haven't had that one in your collection yet, uh, it's kind of nice. See, it says refractor right there. I got a Robocop, which is actually looking pretty good. This is a green green wave. It's at a $2.99, and this is all from the Chrome set that came out, Series 3, and we got an X-Fractor -Fract -X of Brad Habit, um, and those are out of $150, so not, these are actually pretty rare. Actually, really quite nice. Um, I'm going to do all those for 13 bucks. if anybody's interested in these newer GPK right there. And I have some vintage GPK. How about... How about... How about 54A, 54B, Fryan, Ryan, and Chard Chad. I mean, we're talking OS2 goodness right there. 1980, 1985. 
beautiful cards right there. Interestingly, one has a star and one has two stars. I don't know what the deal is with that. Um, but I'm going to sell these both for 10 bucks. If somebody's interested in some vintage GPK, kaboom, right there. Uh, let's see what else. Okay. These ones are actually really cool. I have a whole lot here of 15 bucks each. These are actually, these are actually selling for a lot more than I thought they would be. Uh, I was actually kind of surprised. They're actually selling for more than what I'm selling them for. But we got Blasted Billy too. So this is 1987. Um, uh, pretty cool. Uh, I actually have this in a PSA 10. Um, so I got these. I have three of them. I'm going to do 15 bucks each. So one, two, three. Um, so 15 bucks each to get yourself a nice Blasted Billy. And so they're very actually in really good condition. Um, for what they are. So if you're interested in a Blasted Billy 2, which of course is like an atom bomb variant, go ahead and let me know. And they'll be 15 bucks each. Go ahead and let me know if you want one or more than one down in the comments below. And uh, a couple more GPK related, a couple more GPK related things. I got packs. I actually have some OS5 packs. The packs are a little filthy, but the gum, gum feels broken in some of these. Um, it is sliding around though, which you know means that it's probably not stuck to anything. I've actually I've actually opened some of these packs. They are kind of filthy, but they're in really good shape. I have quantity, so um, if you want a cool OS five um, original series five pack, I'm doing five bucks, five bucks each. So let me know if, how many you want of that. And then check out this whopper right here. This is actually really cool. I actually have a PSA graded PSA eight. 1986 uh, Garbage Pail Kids Series 3 Wax Pack. Got it encapsulated at PSA. Uh, I actually sent in a bunch of PS... I'm actually going to do a video on these <laughs> coming up. My experience with PSA was was interesting. Um, and now I have more packs at PSA. I got them in right before the price jumped again. It's actually really not economical to grade packs anymore. So... Um, this thing is going to be, um, I'm going to sell this for a hundred bucks if anybody really wants it. You know, I just, I just kind of changed my mind on that one right there at the last minute. And that's just because it's going to be like virtually impossible. I mean, it's $50 now to grade one pack, which is insane. Um, I got these in back when it was like 12 bucks a pack to grade. Uh, and then it went up to like 18, something like that. Um, now it's 50. So that's, they're basically telling you not to send in packs <laughs> to grade. So it's a hundred bucks if anybody wants it um, and I'll ship it to you. So it's kind of neat to have, I think it's cool to have graded packs as well. So there you have it, you guys. Uh, let's see. I think that's everything I wanted to. Yeah, I think that's it. So let me know in the comments below what you're interested in. We had soccer, we had baseball, we had football, we had basketball, we have uh, graded cards, we have autographs, we have cool vintage GPK. So just go ahead and comment down below what you want. Send me an email and we'll make it happen. Thanks so much for watching, everybody. Stay safe out there and I'll see you on the next one.